Hi everyone, it's Muriel. Welcome back to my channel. Today I want to share with you the note cards that I completed. I am using the Simple Stories Kissing Booth paper. Um, so I made nine, three, six, nine cards. And um, I just cut them out and embellished them a little bit. So I'll show you each, you'll see each um, cut apart and then you'll see how I altered it. So here's the first one here, Hugs and Kisses. These are about a four by four. So after I layered it with one sheet of paper and then put the card, matted it on a um, card base, it made the card about a four and a half or something like that. So then I made the envelope and um, they're all the same. I'm using that paper that I had so many sheets of um, from crepe paper with the lips and the outside was this black and white um, kind of like a screen look. And then two of them were a little bit bigger, so I'm using the Gal Meets Girl, two sheets of that paper um, for those two cards. So here it is, Hugs and Kisses is pretty plain. So I didn't do much, much, but I did alter a little. I found this arrow in a ephemera pack. And then because it says Hugs and Kisses, I just put three of those kiss stickers on the, um, front of it. On the inside, it just says Happy Valentine's Day. I am using this wonderful stamp that I just bought from my local Goodwill. And it's, oh, here it is here. It is a Heroes Art stamp. And um, I like I like it. I like it a lot. She used a lot of it, um, or used it a lot. But um, I need to go over this little part here because it didn't press, but nonetheless. And then on the back, I have a variety of different ways I put my signature. So that's the first one. Then this one here, it just says smitten, smitten, smitten. What I did was use some of that rosette trim from my stash cream color. This is a bow. I believe this was from um, the Target spot. And then I have a cute little charm hanging of an angel like a cupid on a garment tag okay same thing all of them just have the happy valentine's day and on the back with love okay this one here beautiful pattern with a nice rose uh selection of flowers i think those are roses and i use uh, that banner from the dollar spot at target i finally got to use this heart chipboard piece and then I just put this cute little um, green bird on the side same thing in the back just the wit love okay this one here has the um, writing every love story is beautiful but ours is my favorite and has a beautiful heart background I use another one of those chipboard pieces to kind of make it pop just a little um, flower from my stash and then this is those two hearts those almost like mirrored hearts that I stuck on the side okay black background and the with love okay this one here you see it has four scrabble tiles that spell the word love with a beautiful image of a uh, flower uh, background what I did with here is I used one of those um, shaker stickers which I had to uh, glue this down because all of them are coming off. I don't understand why. So I didn't want to try to put the seeds beads back in here. Would have been cute, but I decided not to. And then I just have a uh, mint green sticker that says together. And that took care of that one. Same thing here. And then with the with love. This one here is probably my favorite. Um, I'm using an ephemera pack again from, let me see if I have it. So this is a My Mind's Eye ephemera pack, and I did share, share it with you. So you'll see the two girls here, and then um, I used uh, a banner, and then I used, and I don't think it was from this pack because I don't see it. No, okay. So anyway, it just has the XOXOs with the heart. So what I did was covered it up with the two girls in their cute little dresses. I know who I'm going to give this to. That's why I... I, just, I think it's so sweet. I put one of those um, banner uh, that I had. Sticker says love always. And this little piece here, I thought it was from this ephemera pack, but it is not. 
and it says love beyond words. And of course, that is when you have two sisters holding hands with their cute little dresses. And then the um, I put a uh, heart gem over that uh, existing heart that was there. So that's that one. Happy Valentine's Day on the back. Because it's black, I just cut out a um, scallop circle and then stamped with love. Okay, the next one here, two lovebirds. Nothing odd about that. But what I did was put some diamond stickles on those hearts and then two hearts on their backs and left it like that. Okay, happy Valentine's Day and then the with love. This one here is probably one of my favorites. It's just a mason jar with some hearts in it and a string. So I took some of those um, conversation hearts and just covered them up over these hearts and used a one of the banners from Target, Hello Love, and then one of my bows over that bow. And that took care of that one. Same thing, Valentine's Day and the back. I use a set of lips. I started out with lips. I was talking to my sister because we're online. And um, she said, just use the lips. So I did. I probably did it on two. The last one you can see is just a heart with a bunch of strings connecting it. Pink strings. And these are like nails. And then the background is wood grain. And it says, you tug on my heart strings. So what I did was um, made those um, black to be nails. I put some diamond stickles over it. Uh, the the hearts that were on this little uh, banner here, I took off. They were red because they had moved so you can see where they should have been. I just popped them off and used these glittered hearts here. And then I put two arrows facing each other. You tug on my heartstrings. The inside, happy Valentine's Day. The back has the with love. So that completes nine cards. It was very easy to do. I'm glad I got to use a few of the embellishments and I got to make all of these envelopes. So these cards are ready to go. Some will be mailed. Some will be in happy mail as well. So my next project will be to um, alter the four by six cards. Uh, we'll see what I come up with with that. So you guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you are inspired by this. If you have any comments, leave them down below. And until my next video, you guys take care. Bye now.